Hey cruisers, I'm Sherry with Cruise Tips TV and we're back with another packing tip. Today we're going to talk about what's in our bag, specifically for shore days. Now today we're going to focus on warm weather destinations. So these are the types of things that we're going to take when we go for a day at the beach or a day at the pool off of our cruise ship. We normally start with a bag that's something like this, which I probably found at a discount store or our trusty feather pack from Shack. So everything that you see on the table will fit in here and more, maybe even a beach towel if you needed it. So let's start with our favorite item, our cameras. We usually pack a GoPro, especially if we're gonna do something action related with a flotation device. This works great for pool and ocean days. We also love to pack our smartphone. This is an iPhone 6 Plus and it has amazing video capabilities, even slow-mo. Now let's talk about some logistics. We also like to back up our technology with some portable chargers and of course charging cables and this we keep in a small see-through bag like this so we don't lose it in our backpack. And we also like to pack lots and lots of small bills for shopping. This works great for vendors and even tipping if you're going to a bar. Now you know I'm a germaphobe so of course I'm going to have a bag full of hand sanitizer. But there's also a couple of other things in this bag that you don't want to live without. One is a little bit of tissue for those runny nose days for our little guy. And uh, we also pack some Ziploc bags in here. Empty, clear, plain, beat up plastic bags. This works great when you need to take a wet swimsuit off and throw it in your backpack. So don't forget your Ziploc bags. Of course, hats for the whole family or visors, sunglasses, a little bit of pain reliever in case somebody comes down with a headache baby powder. Now why on earth would you need baby powder? We love this for those days when you are at the beach and you get sand all over your feet and you need to get the sand off. Just sprinkle a little powder on before you put your flip flops back on and you are in business. Of course, don't forget your bottled water. And we like to pack another Ziploc bag full of sunscreen and this one also has goggles in it because we like to swim in the ocean with our goggles so that we don't get burning eyes from the salt water. Now, a few other things that you don't want to forget when you go ashore on a cruise. You definitely want to remember to take your cruise card with you. And in addition to that, you need to pack your photo ID. This is super important. You don't need a passport, but you do want to take your driver's license and your cruise card so you can get back on the ship safely. Well, that's it for this packing episode. If you have any further shore day tips, leave them in the comments below. Thank you so much for watching, and until next time, we'll see you on the high seas. Hey, click me to subscribe.